design and assembly concepts designs custom automated equipment, uh, primarily using SolidWorks as the mechanical uh, CAD tool and uh, National Instruments LabVIEW. In the past, we've developed our machines using SolidWorks for the mechanical side, and we use LabVIEW as the control software to control machine motion vision. The challenges we, we face are um, trying to design a machine uh, as a first off prototype. Uh, we don't have the luxury of, of designing a uh, prototype system and then de designing the production system. So uh, one of the benefits we see with this tool is the ability to, uh, to simulate the tool in CAD before we ever cut any chips or do any software programming on the, f on the final machine. The mechanical engineer can design the machine using SolidWorks and then use the LabVIEW tools that we've created to simulate motion on that uh, piece of equipment. That also gives them the ability to iterate on the design, uh, checking for interference detection, uh, just motion profiling, or if we're violating uh, the mechanical constraints of the overall design of the machine. Static models or pictures, we can show animated models uh, with the, with the uh, projected motion profiles of their uh, piece of equipment. Uh, time study analysis, being able to evaluate uh, all the motions and not, and not miss any pieces because um, this, this actually forces you to, to run the simulation as the, uh, the final product will run. Um, during the development phase, uh, this tool also allows us to start software development uh, earlier on in the process because we can take the CAD models from the mechanical engineers and um, integrate that with, our, with the initial software the ability to, to create a virtual prototype uh, gives us a competitive advantage because we can show our customer uh, what their what their product that they would buy from us would look like before they ever um, before the product's ever created.